Hi, I'm Mo Egger, and uh, this is uh, the lovely Rachel. Hi. And uh, we are, as you can tell, we're here at Louisville. We're at Louisville Slugger Field, the home of the Louisville Bats, the AAA affiliate of the Cincinnati Reds. If you have not come to a game here, I could not recommend it more. It is a right of summer for me. I come every single year. It is a beautiful ballpark. It is not very expensive. It's a great experience. But we're not here just for fun. No, 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 no. no. We, are, we are here to, to answer a very important question. I have, over the last three months, I've been asked three questions, maybe more than any. The first question is, Mo, are, are you even on the air anymore? And the answer is, yeah. They, uh, I, I think every third Tuesday I'm, I'm on. Uh, the, the other question I get, and I get this one a lot, is can you, can you kind of tell me what Rachel's uh, dating situation is? And that requires a long, complicated answer. And that, so you can't do that via Twitter. You we can't get all that info 140 Twitter. characters aren't no, enough. But no, maybe no. the question I get it on the air. I get it on social media. Hell, I get it when I hang out with my family. I get, where's Sam Lecure? Yeah, it's the most asked Yomo question. Where, where's Sam? So we thought, you know what? Let's get in the car, and let's find him. Let's see if we can find Sam Lecure. So we present to you a little, a little piece we're calling. Finding Sam. Inside Louisville Slugger Field, there's actually a brewery slash restaurant inside the ballpark. It's called Against the Grain, and I'm hoping if I mention Against the Grain enough, they'll, they'll send me one of their t-shirts. Anyway, they make their own beer, and so I decided to sit down and have a glass of what they refer to as Juicy Poot, which begs the question, Rachel, have you ever had a Juicy Poot? I can't say that I have. Yeah? What is in Juicy Poot? Well, uh, it's juicy. Have have you seen this? Look closely, okay? Have you seen this man? Uh, yes. Do you know where we can find him? Um. Have you guys seen Sam Lecur? No. Do you know where he might be? Nope. You know, if you look closely, George Garvin Brown, who created the first bottled bourbon, sort of in his own weird way, kind of looks like, kind of looks like Sam McHugh, doesn't he? I'm here now with the unofficial mascot of Twitter, the troll. And uh, they just announced that the game temperature is going to be 89 degrees. I think they're lying because I'm quite literally melting. It's not good for anybody. The 303 batting Irving Falou will lead off here in the bottom of the fifth inning. Falou homered in his last time up, part of a five run third inning for the bats. He stands in against this uh, Bushman cat who uh, winds and throws low, but for a strike. One of the cool things about coming here, one of the cool things I think about the Louisville Bats is uh, the, the name, the, the name of the team, Bats, it's, it's kind of one of those double meanings. Obviously there's bats and, you know, baseball bats, and this is obviously home of uh, Louisville Slugger. And then, but there's also uh, the, the animal, bats, which I find to be terrifying. But in, in all the years I've known Rachel, the one thing that is uh, sort of, I, I've had the hardest time wrapping my brain around is her kind of vague, non-specific, weird fetish she has for bats. Yeah. Got a lot of 
myself a lot of stuff there. I know, we can expense this, right? <laughs> there are weeks I can't believe my paycheck clears, and you think we're gonna expense that. It's work-related. There are months I'm surprised we can make payroll, and you want us to pay for that. Do you think we can expense $5 nail decals? Louisville Bats nail decals? Louisville Bats, they go on your nails. If you play your cards right, $5? Yes. If you play your cards right, maybe, just maybe, by the end of the night, I'll buy those for you. Falou tries to lay down a bunt. It's, it's fielded by Bushman. He has a hard time handling it, and Falou is going to reach first base with a leadoff bunt single. Rachel, do you have any thoughts? It's hotter than mule's ass out here today, Mo. She's not the best color man in the business for nothing, folks. You're a very good looking man. Can I just say that? That's awesome. To, that's Thank you for the compliment. Yeah. But I like your shirt. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Have you uh, have you seen this man? Yes. Do, do, you, do you know who that is? Sam LaCure. Any idea where, where maybe we can we can find him? Uh, single A. Ouch, okay. And you, do you know who Sam LaCure is? No. He owns a liquor company, correct. Thank you very much. Sam Liqueur's Liquors. Where have you seen Sam Liqueur? Here, on, pitching for the bats. Pitching for the bats? Yeah. So I could find him here? Should. I hope so. We're here in Louisville. We are looking for uh, a guy by the name of uh, Sam Liqueur. Have you seen him? No, I haven't. Give me your, your top five favorite words that rhyme with Sam. Pam, uh, Pan, uh, Pan. Dan, Lamb. Okay, now give me your top five words that rhyme with liqueur. So we're behind the scenes, Louisville Slugger Field, and I think we are this, this close, this close to finding Sam Liqueur. Come on. We found Sam LaCure, here he is, we found him. He's here in Louisville. You look like you're doing well. I'm feeling well. You look like you're doing well? I'm Everything's doing well. good? Yeah. yeah, are you okay? I'm okay. You sure? I'm better now, for a friendly face. Uh, well, uh, I don't know about mine, maybe. I yours. wasn't talking about you. Yeah, very good, very, very, <laughs> very fair right there. All right, uh, so don't take this the wrong way. First, let's talk a little baseball. I, I, look, at, I look at the numbers. That's very un-Sam LaCure-like. Should I not put any stock into the numbers? Are you are you inching closer to, to maybe me being able to like not have to drive to Louisville to see you? I think so. I yeah. feel like, yes, very un-Sam numbers, but if you look over the past several, they're getting better, and they're going to keep getting better. Yeah, Definitely. how do you feel about the team's lack of distinctive facial hair right now? Well, that just goes to show you, I mean, what a big part of the team that I was. I mean, it was more than just a backdoor fastball that I brought to the table. You know, I was I was really disappointed not to be in the ballpark for mustache night. Yeah. There was yeah. a mustache yeah, giveaway missed, night. And there's I missed, mustaches yeah. all around yeah. town now for the All-Star game. Yeah, I felt yeah. like if there was a time I was going to be called up, that would have been it. You have a lot of fans in Cincinnati who miss you, who love you, who want you to come back. Uh, how did it feel in the midst of what had to be a difficult time to sort of feel the the outpouring of support from from a lot of Reds fans. It was absolutely awesome. I, uh, you know, I, my mom called me. You know, obviously she was a little bit down about it too. She's like Sam. She's like, I think you're a great ball player, but seeing all those people reach out to you on Twitter and such, yeah. that tells me you're a great person. She's like, I couldn't be more proud of you. Uh, so fans in Cincinnati, thank you so much. I, I really appreciate it. Touched me in my heart, and uh, I am working my tail off to get back up there and, and light those stacks up. Well, it's, this is one of the classiest guys you're, you're Best person meet. to work with. Yeah. We, everybody in here has worked with him personally yeah. on broadcast yeah. and couldn't be a nicer dude to work yeah. with um, in the professional athlete world. I have a I'm blushing. Yeah, you are. Bit, we bit. can't tell. But <laughs> we, I do. I want you to do me, do me a favor. We've been uh, asking around town if people have seen you. And I've asked a, a handful of people to, to rank an order from worst to best. The following seven Sams. Are you ready? I'm ready. Sam Houston. Sam Elliott, Sam Weish, Sam I Am, Sam Malone, Sam Adams, and Sammy Davis Jr. Whoo! That's a good list of Sams. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go Sam Elliott, top of the list. Top of the list? Yeah, top okay. of the list. Tombstone? Tombstone. Yeah. Sam, Sam, okay, yes. Sam Elliott. Sam Elliott, I'm gonna go Sam I Am. Sam I Am, okay. Dr. Seuss. Because 
Why not? Okay. I gotta leave a list. list. We have nice. a list. Yeah. Yeah, I got Sam Elliott. I got Sam I Am. Sam Adams. Yeah. Sam Houston. Yeah. I was Strong. I was I lived in Texas for Flies many on years. The list. He's yeah. big there. Sam Malone. I've been to the actually been to the Cheers bar in Boston. A little disappointing. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, a little disappointing. It was it just yeah. Didn't quite have that same feel no to fat it. Guy sitting at the end of the uh, Sammy Davis Jr. Yeah. and I don't know who Sam Weish is. I'm Who's sorry. Who's the coach of the Bengals when they went to the Super Bowl? But you were like seven years old, so you get a and chance not that. a. That's fine. No problem. It, at that well, point, it, I am now. When you come back, you'll be a Bengals Sam fan. Sam Weish, move you have up the any list. He, we have to let him go to work. Do you have any questions remaining uh, for for Sam? Sam yeah, here. Anything else you want to say to the fans who have been asking us repeatedly Where on Twitter? Is which Sam? led to this adventure? You Where know? is Sam Lecure? They've been asking. Uh, well, for the foreseeable future, I'll be in Louisville, uh, and shortly after that, I'll be back in Cincinnati and you'll be able to find me at your local Newport Kroger. <laughs> <laughs> Sam LeCure, everybody. Thank, Thank you, sir. You. Thank you, guys. I appreciate He's it. He's the best. Thanks, Thanks Sam. Rachel. Appreciate it.